Hello, Nicole here with After the Rulebook, and today I'll be playing a two-player game of Point Salad. I will be putting my opponent's cards on the left side, and then mine will be on the right side. And I'll go first. I'm going to take this point card here of one point per onion and one point per carrot. My opponent will be doing the same thing, but for peppers and tomatoes. I'm going to take this one. My opponent's going to take this one. I will take an onion and a carrot. They're going to take a tomato and a pepper. I'm going to take a carrot and a lettuce. And that means I do have one set for this one, so hopefully I can get another onion and lettuce. They will take a pepper and an onion. I will take a lettuce and an onion. They're going to take this point card. I'm going to take this one, three points per veggie type with at least two. They're going to take two tomatoes. I'm going to take this one because I already have the carrots and the onions, so all I need are cabbages. So they're going to take this point card, but there is an optional action to flip it into the vegetable. So they're going to just take an onion. On my turn, since I just got that point card with cabbages, I will take two cabbages. We're going to take the two tomatoes. I'm going to take the carrot and cabbage. I'm trying to get another set of the one over here, so I need an onion still. So I'm going to take the two peppers. They get three points each for those, but then they're also trying to go for that top card for onions, tomatoes, and peppers. So I think they want some more onions. I'm going to take this card as an onion because that completes another set of these three. And then if I can get one more lettuce, it's another set of those. So that's, that's a big point card. They are definitely going to take this one. Three peppers for eight points. I definitely want a lettuce. And then I think I'm going to take a tomato to hopefully get two cards there so I can get three points from this card. They're going to get this point card. Most peppers equals 10 points.
So this card gives me six points at the moment, but this card, I already have one set, so that would be eight victory points right now. And if I can get another tomato, that'll be eight more. That was a good one. My opponent really likes this pepper strategy, so they're going to get one point per pepper and a point per onion. I'm going to get a carrot and a cabbage. Hopefully I'm building up to another set of this one, so I need one more onion for that one. My opponent is definitely taking these two peppers because every set of three equals eight points and that gives them another eight points. I'm going to take two more lettuce. My opponent wants this one. Three tomatoes equals eight points. So they already have eight. They need one more tomato to get another set. I'm going to take this one. Most cabbage equals 10 points, and I have the most right now. They're going to take an onion and a pepper. I'm going to take this card and flip it over to a tomato so that I can get another set for this one, which is eight points. This is a 15 point card for my opponent. Five points for each veggie type with at least three. I'm going to take this one, one point per tomato and carrot. My plan is just going to take this point card and flip it over to a pepper. This is a nice card for me right now. I have two sets right now, so that's 16 points. They're going to take this point card and flip it over, so that gets them nine peppers. This is an eight point card for me. They're going to take this point card and flip it over. That gives them another set for the onion, tomato, and pepper, which gives them eight more points. This is a 15 point card for me right now because I have three full sets. Flipping this over will give my opponent six tomatoes which is another eight points. I'm gonna take two cabbages, because that gives me six cabbages, and I have the card that gives me eight points for every three. They would definitely like this one, two points for every pepper. That's an 18 point card for them. This is an eight point card for me right now. They're gonna take this card because they have six full sets times five. That's a 30 point card for them, wow.
This is a 15 point card for me. They're gonna take this card and flip it over. This is a 15 point card for me right now. They're going to take this card and flip it over. I'm going to take this card and flip it over. They're going to take this card and flip it over. I'm going to take two carrots. They're going to take two lettuce. And I'm stuck with the cabbage and carrot. I'm going to go through each card that I have. So this one is one point per onion and carrot and I have 10 together this one says one per tomato and one per carrot so that is also 10 this one is five points for every pair of lettuce and onion so I have three onions and then I have more lettuce so that means I have three sets so 3 times 5 is 15. This one is 8 points per lettuce, carrot, and onion set. So the smallest number I have here is onion, which is 3. So 3 times 8 is 24. This one is cabbage, carrot, and tomatoes. The smallest one I have there is tomatoes, which is three. Three times eight is 24. This one is carrot, cabbage, and onion. The smallest one there is onion, which is three times eight is 24. This one says five points for every pair of cabbages. So I have I have seven cabbages, so that would be three times five. Most cabbages, my opponent did not have any, so I got the 10 points. One point per carrot and lettuce. I have 12 of those combined. Five points for every pair of carrot and onion. I only have three onions, so that would be 15 points. The next one is eight points for every three cabbages. I have seven cabbages, so that would be two times eight, so 16. Three points per veggie type with at least two, and I have five of them, so that would be 15 points. And my last card I have here is tomato, onion, and lettuce. So this, I have three of those, so that would be 24 points. So I wrote down the scores for both of us, and I had more point cards than they did but I got 214 and they got 216. It was so close, but look at this point card. That was actually this one. They had five of these sets, which added up to 40 points for just this one card. I didn't have anything close to 40, so that was pretty amazing. Thanks for watching. I hope you liked this video. Please give it a like and subscribe for more videos like this. Bye.